Yeah, it does feel really good to like have a first round win. That way, you get all your nerves out for districts. I mean, it's like, okay, when you're done, you're done for the season. You're not like you don't have another second second chance. And so, I mean, I'm just glad that I got to help my team to get there. And going into the eighth inning, I was like, ooh, this might be really close. But good thing we uh, we like got down and we did what we needed to do to get that win. You give up six in the seventh. What was that dugout like when you guys came back out for that eighth inning? I mean, it had to have been, I, I would think, pretty uh, I mean, tough for you guys to come back out, but how were you guys able to respond there in the eighth? Well, I know a lot of people were nervous or getting down on themselves, but I was just glad everybody was like, okay, we're in the eighth inning. we got to get here. We can't have redos. We can't have anything. We just need to get it done, and we don't need to pat our heads on that last inning because that's not going to help us any at all. It's not going to help us. You had a big three-run double that kind of opened things back up there in the eighth. Uh, six runs batted in for you tonight. I mean, what was working for you at the plate tonight? Well, I think it was just staying back because I usually am not very good on slower pitchers. I usually uh, pop them up every single time. So I was just – I was really glad that I got those hits out there because, I mean, I was just – I was getting nervous before the game of how I'm going to be able to hit off of, the, off of a slower pitcher. And, like, some of the hits, they were – they were good, and uh, a couple of them, you know, I, they were out there, and I was just glad that I could hit it out there. Well, that's a, a tough turnaround. you got to turn it back around play tomorrow. Play a pretty good team there in trainer. I mean, what's it going to take to, to go in and, and try to have a chance up there? Well, we've played trainer pretty close a couple of times. So, I mean, we just need to not be like, oh, it's trainer. Like, be like their name. We need to play them for just another team out there in the next round. If we need to win because, like, it's – like we played IKM last year and stuff, and like it's oh it's IKM Manning. No, we don't need to think that. We can do it. Like we, if we just get out there, get on them, you know, just don't think how amazing they are their last year season or anything. You know, I mean we play them all the time. We can we can do it. We can we can jump on them and we can get out there and get it. Uh, yeah, a win's a win at this point in the year. We're still playing, um, so that was the important thing. Yeah, we would have liked that to have gone a little bit better, but. You know, take the first six innings, and I couldn't ask for better pitching and defense with that. Um, I I was concerned coming in with our hitting. Uh, we have struggled when we've faced slower pitchers, and so um, I've tried everything I could to prepare us and practice and, and hope that it would come through. And uh, luckily, Kinsey was the one that came up when we got some people on in front of her, and that made a huge difference that she drove in runs. So, you know, in that last inning, um, Hannah drawn the walk and we got her bunted over hoping for one run, but it sure did make playing the, bo the bottom of that eighth inning a lot easier after getting five. I mean, take me through getting out of the bottom of the seventh. I mean, they had a, well, it looked like a pretty good shot, not just to tie it, but to win it there in the bottom of the seventh. You get out. I mean, what was that coming back? I mean, what was kind of the, what were you trying to tell the team to get them going again for the eighth? Well, um, in that bottom of the seventh, at first, you know, I just thought we just need outs when they got a few runners on. I didn't want to pull the infield in and get you know, something that should be a routine ground ball that turns into a base hit. And um, unfortunately, we had that play that could have happened at second base that would have been an out. Um, the line drive that went off Brooks' glove there um, could have been an out. You know, there's so many things that could have changed things uh, right away with us that didn't. But, um, you know, she got a big strikeout for us. We had a couple then good defensive plays to get out of that inning. Um, so then when they came in, I said, we need to take the momentum back right away. We can't let them build on getting powered up with that. Um, so, you know, we, we jumped on them, got those runs, but when they went out, you know, I think they played with confidence. They, they didn't act nervous and I'm sure having five run lead once again, uh, helped things that were one run would have made it a little stickier when they had a couple runners on, but. Uh, talk about Brooke. I mean, she was great through six. I mean, I think she had retired 15 in a row at one point. But then, uh, I mean, her, yeah, she, that was tough in the seventh, but she got the out she needed right. and then came on and had a, an okay eighth to finish it off. Right. That, you know, she, the last part of this season, she's been throwing well. Um, she's cut down her walks considerably and getting more strikeouts. So those first six innings is kind of how she's been doing. I think some of it could have been the heat throwing um, into that seventh inning, they also started making her throw more pitches, that they were taking more pitches than they were earlier in the game where she was getting some strikes because they were swinging at things that maybe wouldn't have been called um, and they weren't swinging at those in um, that seventh inning. But, um, you know, it's we also haven't played, you know, I, I think that hurts us as the regular season. We're playing three, four nights a week um, and then we get to this last part of the season and we're taking three, four days off and that's, you know, it's hard to stay consistent and I think that, you know, sometimes can hurt you a little bit too. So, 
when you don't get any days off, have to play the defending champions tomorrow night. I mean, Kinsey said it. I mean, the team you've seen, you played with them a couple times. I mean, what's it going to take to go in and try to pull an upset tomorrow night? Uh, well, it, it'll be a whole different type of hitting. That's one thing. But um, this year we have done better against trainer and we have in years. Uh, we've put the ball in play. We've made some things happen. Um, we've got some big hits. Uh, the key will be how Brooke throws, number one, and if our defense stays strong without without giving them any big innings. I think that's the thing is that uh, you, you can't let them get a big inning because they really take advantage of that. Um, but, you know, I, I think we should probably have as much confidence as we ever have playing them uh, because we have been scoring runs against them this year. There's been some other teams that have beat them, so, you know, they're not – they're not unbeatable, and I think sometimes that's the way people go in thinking, oh, no one else has been able to beat them. And so, you know, I, I think our kids have the right attitude right now is that, yeah, we can play with them and we can give them a game.